covered by you, so that will be fine. And enjoying good health. Today, I have selected a topic on trachoma, uh, chlamydia trachoma. So, it is a very common disease which causes blindness worldwide. So, let us discuss what it is. Trachoma is a disease of the eye caused by infection with the bacterium Chlamydia trachomatis. It is a public health problem in 42 countries and is responsible for the blindness or visual impairment of about 1.9 million people. Blindness from trachoma is irreversible. So what are the key facts? Trachoma is a disease of the eye caused by infection with the bacterium Chlamydia trachomatis. It is a public health problem in 42 countries and is responsible for blindness by visual impairment about 1.9 million people. And blindness from trachoma is irreversible. Based on June 2022 data, 125 million people live in trachoma endemic areas and are at risk of trachoma blindness. Infection is spread through personal contact by hands, clothes, bedding or, ha or hard surfaces and by flies that have been in contact with discharge from the eyes or nose of an infected person. With repeated episodes of infection over many years, the eyelashes may be drawn in so that they rub on the surface of the eye. This causes pain and may permanently damage the cornea. In 2021, 69,266 people received surgical treatment for advanced stages of the disease and 64.6 million people were treated with antibiotic. Global antibiotic coverage in 2021 was 44%. Then we come to the overview of the trachoma. Trachoma is the leading infectious cause of blindness worldwide. It is caused by an obligate intracellular bacterium called Chlamydia trachomatis. The infection is transmitted by direct or indirect transfer of eye and nose discharges of infected people, particularly young children, who harbor the principal reservoir of infection. And these discharges can be spread by particular species of flies. Then epidemiology and clinical features. In areas where trachoma is endemic, active inflammatory trachoma is common among preschool Aged children with prevalence rates which can be as high as 60 to 90 percent. Infection becomes less frequent and shorter in duration with increasing age. Infection is usually acquired when living in close proximity to others with active diseases and the family is the main setting for transmission. An individual's immune system can clear a single episode of infection but in endemic communities, reacquisition of the organism occurs frequently. After years of repeated infection, the inside of the eyelid can become so severely scarred, trachomatous, conjunctival scarring that it turns inwards and causes the eyelashes to rub against the eyeball, trachomatous trichiasis, resulting in constant pain and light intolerance. This and other alterations of the eye can lead to scarring of the cornea. Left untreated, this condition lead to the formation of irreversible opacities, resulting in visual impairment of blindness and the age at which this occurs depends on several factors including local transmission intensity in high in very high endemic communities, it can occur in childhood. The onset of visual impairment between the ages of 30 and 40 years is more typical. Visual impairment or blindness results in a worsening of the life experience of affected individuals and their families who are normally already amongst the poorest of the poor. Women are blinded up to four times as often as men. So I hope so that this video will be more informative for the audience and if you have liked this video then kindly subscribe to my channel and kindly share this video with other individuals as well and have a wonderful nice day thank you for listening this video thank you very much